should I talk about today? I switch because I have a discussion with him. He said, Who are interested about your college life? Tell us about you more about yourself. So, about my college life, let me start uh, why I choose this topic. The topic today, or the reason why, is it has changed my life. The college life probably only three or four years, but it does it still change, it still affect a lot of my current present daily life. About my school, it's in a very special place. It's the country is well known as low land, low country, and famous with the delicious cheese. So I guess where it is. Where? <coughs> Not the Netherlands. <laughs> That's uh, the Netherlands the official name official name for international wise. Um, the school is located the second biggest city in Netherlands, which is Rotterdam by population wise, the second the second biggest city, the first one is Amsterdam, and then the third one is the Den Haag. If you've been to Holland you probably read the Netherlands, you probably know about it. So this school is also famous. Our, our school actually specializes for business administration. And they have a very famous program. It's called Exchange Program. The Exchange Program means that you can choose for one or two semesters to our one, one of our sister school, which is located in Europe. They're probably in Spain, in Germany, in France. That's really a lot of people try to gain the school to join this program. And of course, this program in English instead of Dutch. But we also have to learn Dutch. If you are not Dutch, you have to learn Dutch language and you have to pass the exam as well. So, another way, uh, in another hand, that means 50% of my classmates all from different nationalities. It's like you can imagine we are in the same room and small, uh, small room is like small un uh, united nation. The, you, you, you sit together with the people from France, from Germany, from Spain, from Italy or Russia. I think one of the uh, first questions is from Syria, which is now in the words, in uh, civil wars in the country. And my best friend also is from Syria as well. For a Bali school, of course, we have some Taiwanese in China as well, and I'm the only Taiwanese as a minority, as always, and the only one in the class, but only one and the Taiwanese in the class. How do I survive this multinational environment. Of course we have a common language in English. Um, also what I learned from about this environment as well. When I was just new at school, the senior told us, um, if you want to pass your exam and graduate on time, make German classmate as your best friend. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Funny right? Make German classmate as your best friend. So this is a joke, a very famous joke in our school. We always, the teacher always asks us because multinationality. So the teacher say, if you want to do the assignment, the same thing, you can't have two same nationality in the group. So there are five members in one group. We have a German, French, Dutch, Chinese, and Spanish. So they are assigned assignment together. They say, oh, you have to do this part, this part, this part. So five of them together. Okay, we got to meet you next week, 10 o'clock. Let's discuss the result of final part. So we put together and hand over to the teacher. So of course, one, one week later, one week later, German got there earlier with the perfect report. So super detailed, excellent job. So we were sitting there. Then, the Chinese came. Turn to the, okay, let me see. Didn't <laughs> <laughs> it's not even the eye contact. That's the Chinese. The, then the French and the Dutch comes. This is my part. Okay, but I don't like what we discussed last time, so I changed a little bit. <laughs> okay? So this is my part. So the result's like, well, it's too direct because without any discussion, they change. Okay, then, of course, French a little bit. <laughs> With the paper on the table. And check it out German, Chinese. And uh, what is the other one? Dutch. 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 And the French, the French says, 
No, I don't like F F stone. It's all not good, not good, not good. <laughs> they, they are the best in the world. <laughs> so the, the, the last one, that's uh, the Spanish. So now later the Spanish is not coming. <laughs> then the Spanish is like, well, uh, they would try calling Spanish uh, classmate. They call, she say, uh, what? Do we have assignment? Do we have a meeting? <laughs> <laughs> so you know how to survive, you know. Make friends. So how do I make friends? So when I make friends at the school, that was one, one, one very funny story. I remember how I met friends. I met my friends with a different little mom to make sure I can bridge on time. So I'm in Taiwan, in Taiwan, so I really tried hard to make friends with them. But you know there was a group. They speak the same language, they the same group, they come together, and nobody won't talk with you. Even you're pretty, they don't. <laughs> <laughs> then, one time when we were in class, uh, my teacher asked me one thing, especially. He said, we want to introduce myself. My teacher said, oh, you're from Taiwan. So, the Taiwan is a part of China. <laughs> wow. In that situation, 50 people, 10 percent Chinese people in class. How can you ask the group without argument and make the rest of them happy with the answer and appreciate? You know what I say? I said, oh, my boyfriend is great Belgian, by the way. I said, does Belgian profit in the Netherlands? <laughs> because in 1839, Belgium dependent from the United Kingdom of the Netherlands. So they hate it. They hate that say that. After class, the Dutch came to me. In the brief friendship, Lulu, I just love what you say, you earn our respect. You have a coffee with us? <laughs> I got friends. Yes, they're from German, Germany, they are from non nationalities. What I learned from this school, really, three things, three tips for you. Three tips, okay, also. <laughs> three tips with, for me. Uh, first, effective communication skill is important in this department. The second one, respect the notice, cultural wise skin color, everything. The third one, encouraging wording helps build the confidence. I hope those things can help you to the daily life. Tianyi.